Well, two things happened. Number one, we came and, and made sure that uh, a World War II veteran uh, was made to feel welcome into our organization that she hadn't been a part of before. And then we wanted to bring this group of, of great uh, people from the Department of Vermont uh, together to talk about women's issues, whether it be health care issues or is the issue of being accepted as a, as a member of the, of the American Legion family. And if we want to grow as an organization, we're going to have to make some changes. So that's the reason Vermont has been called here. Maybe this will be the spark that will lead us into it, into that right direction. Uh, I always say, I always talk about the little clusters of light that I can see uh, when I'm flying all over this country. You're a part of that here in Ludlow. You're one of those clusters of light doing those things for your post, for the community, and for the veterans in your community. For so long, women, though we carried our weight, though we did the things that we were supposed to do in the military, have always been looked at as more of a tier two kind of a veteran, you know, that we weren't exactly um, by definition a veteran, that maybe we were veter veterans by default that we served. We did a women veteran survey uh, in 2011 and one of the most shocking things was that women didn't really identify themselves as veterans. We asked the question, are you a veteran? And many women said no. And then we asked the same question to the same women, did you serve in the military? And they said yes. So as a woman veteran, outreach events like this help women understand that we understand the veterans, that they are veterans, and we understand the service and the sacrifice, and we want to honor them. So today was just a great event as a legionnaire and as a woman for the American Legion to come out and say thank you. What's in your heart is what keeps this organization going. And I thank you for that, for being here and being part of the American Legion family. But when you learn what the American Legion is all about and the four pillars that we're based on, it, it gets in your heart. And to see how we affect our community and the youth champions that we have, I feel like the American Legion is all about making this country strong and making it the America that all of us, male and female, the country we fought for, the people we raised our hands, we said that we would defend our country, and no one ever said, you're done. You take off the uniform, but you continue to serve. And, and that's what the Legion is to me. More and more of the uh, female veterans are going to become a part of this great organization, and we're going to continue to grow and, and do good things for communities and for the veterans in the community. That the American Legion wholeheartedly thanks every American who raised their hand and who um, served our country, men and women. Ever since its inception, almost 100 years ago, the American Legion has allowed women to be part of it, and it's, it's never been about gender, it's about service.